pretty sure. Let me see. Let's pick up all yeah, that's it. Are you in your normal No, it looks like you're somewhere somewhere else. Alright, Daddy O. Surplus power should translate to increased efficiency and productivity. There you sure. are. Ah, there you are. You've met with the director. I assume they made their intentions known. It was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility. What about you? You agree with their decision? Yeah, I got no problem with that. It's the only way we can ensure the Institute's safety. That makes it the right thing to do. I'm glad you agree. None what comes next will be easy. That conviction may help keep us all going. You know, Father, it's no secret that you worked with the Railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? They mean nothing to me. Never have. I'll admit. Especially Deacon. I'm relieved to hear <laughs> that. Then I certainly hope I can count on you for what needs to be done. Because these fanatics cannot be allowed to continue to exist. They represent a very clear threat to the Institute. Small as they are in number. Their twisted ideology ensures that they will never stop trying to strike at us. They must be eradicated. All right. Are you willing to see to it? It's clobbering time. You don't have to worry about them any longer. They're as good as dead. Thank you. Do what needs to be done, but keep yourself safe. Done and done. All right, finally. First order of business, kill Desdemona. Let's get out of here. Get back into the war. Okay, so I don't want my uh, mysterious serum to wear off until I've dumped off these mini nukes, so I'm just going to have to remain... Oh, I'm no longer tired. What's my situation now? How did I not get tired? Oh, yeah, right. I'm caffeinated. <laughs> okay, let's boogie. We have to go to the railroad. We're just going to have to hoop it. We're going to take my safe route here. Take Newberry all the way along here. I believe this is Newberry all the way along past the Boston Public Library over to uh, the park there. Take that street north past uh, Good Neighbor in the Mass Fusion Building up here and over to the Old North Church. That's the plan. Let's do it. Okay, just passing Hangman's Alley on the, the right there. Up at the top of the hill is Newberry, I believe. Yes. Hang a left here. Carry on. And head straight east to the park. Okay, there's Swan's Pond Park on the... Oh my gosh, he's like activated. Okay, let's just leave Big Boy alone there. Just passing through there, Big Boy. Stay calm. Nothing to see here. Okay, we'll turn north here. Approaching the mass fusion building up ahead. There's the mass fusion building. Good neighbors over there. Sometimes a dog respawns over here. It did. Okay, let's take care of him. Up and over. The old corner bookstore is off to my right there. Let's take this alleyway here. It's the safest route. Passing by Haymarket Mall on my right there. <laughs> yes. I'll be your tour guide through. Oh my gosh, there's somebody behind me. Let's just get away from that. We don't want to get involved here. 
Okay, let's keep pushing towards the, uh, yeah, this is the exact street we want to be on. The cemetery is there. So straight down the street should take us right up to Old North Church. There's a church right there. Now, what you can do is go up to that little, uh, raider place that we cleared out earlier, just north of Pickens Gallery. Save the game there. It's a good bed, too. But I don't want to sleep too much because I don't want to wear off my mysterious serum. It's right over here. Shoot, everything should be clear here. There we go. That way, if things go horribly wrong when we take over the, the railroad, uh, get a second chance. Okay, let's go. And I need some food and I'm tired. A couple of fancy lads. And wash it down with some Nuka Cherry. There we go. That didn't do it. I must be, be getting really tired. Oh yeah, and I can level up too. For what it's worth, let's pump another point into intelligence. Alright, let's go whack the railroad. Nothing personal, Deacon, but if you had you just been a better stealther, we wouldn't be doing this, you know. Okay, here's the plan. We're just gonna go in. And sucker punch Desdemona with a mini nuke. And then everyone is everybody's gonna rush our position at the door. And we're just gonna keep sucker punching everybody else with mini nukes. Um, Glory may approach. If we can get her close enough, she's gonna drop her minigun and we can use that to finish everybody off. That's the plan. Let's do it. The most dangerous part of this plan is not killing yourself with splash damage from the mini nuke. <laughs> For me, anyways. <laughs> All right, Desdemona, nothing personal. Fucking cow! This is worth a psycho. There she is. Back up. She's dead. And they should Find all rush it. our position here. What the? What just happened? <laughs> Missions are failing. Hurry up, reload. Oh shit, here they come. Got him. Oh my gosh. The carnage. And that is it. I want that, uh, hear that minigun. Sorry, drummer boy. <laughs> you know, what, a, what a solution, eh? I'm a bad boy. Deacon, Tinker Tom, everybody bought it. Every, oh man, the car, the humanity, the carnage. I could use some 45. I should look carefully around for 45 cal rounds. Okay, so I'm just going to do that right now. I'll be back in a minute. Oh, shit. Pam's still alive. Uh, we're going to leave her alone. We weren't given any instructions to bring her back or anything, so I'll just leave that alone. Okay, I don't want to push my luck. Let's just get out of here. The Institute's a big place. It might take okay, a while to Father it. is this way. Is he in his regular place? I think he is. So... Easiest way to find fathers, look for the green shopping bag, there it is, and then just take those stairs up. Scanning. Subject identified. Major of slack. Kicker of ass has arrived. 
greetings, Slack. Hey, father. <laughs> so. The work is done. I am sorry. I know it was likely difficult for you. Yeah, it wasn't that difficult. Nope. Not a problem at all. I regret that it came to this, even if you don't. There was just no way to compromise with those people. There is obviously one final threat the Institute faces. There's just no end to this, is there? Yeah. There is. And we've almost reached it. Just one last hurdle. The Brotherhood of Steel covets technology, and has made it clear that we cannot peacefully coexist. They will eventually come for us, and attempt to take what we've spent so long creating. We need to destroy them before they can destroy us. You're right. We take the fight to them. I'm glad you agree. But the problem with the Brotherhood of Steel goes beyond the edges of the Commonwealth. It's not enough to destroy them here. There are more of them out there in the world, Father. And they too will come for us. So even if we fight them here, eventually we're screwed? Oh, not necessarily. We will show them that if they interfere with us, the very technology they value so highly will be turned against them. We will teach them that we can appear at a moment's notice, wherever we please, and they cannot ever stop us. They will know better than to ever interfere with us again. You seem pretty convinced this will work. The Institute is nothing if not thorough. Dr. Lee should be expecting you in her lab. She can fill you in on the details. Time is of the essence. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be a bitch. This is the last Institute mission. If we can do this, I will have beaten Survival Plus. This is gonna be a bitch, though. Okay, let's go start to do uh, talk to Dr. Lee and get this thing started. I know you'll achieve great things here. We all do. You've done well so far, but the evaluation is far from over. Dr. Lee. What can I do for you? Sean says it's time. Ah, that. Well, let's get to it. Dr. Orman, over here, please. It's time. What now? I'm still working over the code that the robotics sent over. The algorithm is a mess. It's not even close to peak efficiency. It would seem we've run out of time. Let's go. We're going to cover the basics of the operation as it stands now. Dr. Orman has done most of the prep work, so I'll let her explain. Okay, thanks. Is this really exciting, or is it just me? So, you know it's that the Brotherhood's <laughs> main operation is at the airport, right? I'm aware of that, yes. Okay, good. If they were a little less intelligent, we wouldn't even be talking about this. We'd have just swarmed them with synths. But they're not idiots. They've managed to generate an EM field that's messing with our ability to relay in. So we just relay onto the airship and sabotage it. Won't do us any good. There's no direct connection between their robot and the airship. So the immediate area around their encampment is a no-go. They don't, however, have the entire airport covered. We can relay you into a point at the edge of the airport, and then you can get in and take down the generators. We'll have the element of surprise, if nothing else. Exactly. You'll have surprise on your side. Should give you some time before they can organize a real defense. For every generator you take down, it means we can start relaying in synths, giving you even more of an advantage. And, oh, I almost forgot. Take these. Oh, thanks. Grenades. Sure, I can always use grenades. <laughs> no, no, they're not grenades. This thing, and I haven't come up with a good name for it yet, it basically deploys a beacon marker. Wherever they land, we can lock onto them and relay synths directly to that position. If there's a hot spot, you can drop synths right on it. We've only got a few of these, so put them to good use. Don't go tossing them into the bay. Duh. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's pretty good. I'm impressed. I know, right? I mean... Thanks. I thought it was neat. But still, it's just to help. Your real job will be to reach Liberty Prime. You know the deal with that, right? It's the Brotherhood's giant robot. Right. They think it's their ultimate weapon. We're going to show them it's ours. We've taken everything we know, made a few modifications based on what we think they've done with it in the past 10 years. 
and this part was my idea uploaded the whole thing into a modified synth capable of delivering the virus directly into liberty prime the little guy is going to be exposed and vulnerable so you'll have to keep an eye on him make sure he doesn't get shot you know with liberty prime on our side that'll give us a hell of an advantage he's not going to go stomping around and he won't be taking orders but he will have his weapons and targeting systems overridden. And he'll absolutely recognize their airship as the primary communist target in the Commonwealth. So your end goal is ultimately pretty simple. Get to the robot, then hold the position while the synth does his thing. Oh, and don't worry, we'll pull you out of there before everything explodes. If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Otherwise, they'll be waiting for you in the relay room. <laughs> oh, real simple. Yeah, sure. <laughs> If it's so simple, why don't the fuck you do it? <laughs> Anyways, uh, plan B, I've always wanted to ask that question. Have we got a plan B? We don't need a plan B. Oh, okay. This will work. <laughs> so much Anything for that else? idea. Uh, what have I got for backup? Once the generators are down, we'll be able to throw everything we've got at them. And I do mean everything. Yeah, that's the deal. Take down the generators and then they swarm them with synths. Um, it's still gonna be, it's still gonna be hell. Okay, so that's it, we're done. No questions. Let's do this. Very well. Good luck to you. Dr. Lee might not show it, but I can tell she's excited about having Okay, so can we fast travel directly out of here? Because I want to go to Hangman's Alley and get organized as far as my weaponry and everything before we relay to the airport and get this party started. Okay, now, what's my weight like? Uh, a little heavy, so let's go straight to Hangman's Alley. I gave up alcohol after settling down here. Doctor said I shot my liver. That's nice. Okay, so let's save the game. New Coca-Cola is the only thing I can drink that wakes me up. Otherwise, yeah, I just want to get away from Sheffield to sign up. That is it, people. Thanks a lot for watching. Coming up next, the big kahuna, the last hurrah, the oh slack, you're in deep shit now. Uh, yeah, this is it. Airship down, the final mission for the Institute. Uh, it's going to be a bitch. Don't miss out. Thanks a lot for watching. And if you thought this video was remotely entertaining and or informative, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this hot off the press. All right. See you next video.